Hi folks, uh, I'm back with a short update on uh, the thin film uh, membranes. Um, I ran a few tests and uh, experimented around with a few other things and uh, forget what I said about the using the uh, white glue, you don't need it. Uh, this I've got an easier way and it makes a better membrane too. Uh, this is a piece of the uh, uh, the typing paper that I uh, soaked in borax on both sides both in the earlier video and uh, and this is the uh, cellulose acetate uh, in acetone and what I did was I ended up thinning this down a little bit because it, it, just the cellulose acetate and acetone with the borax will form a film too um, and so I thinned it down a little bit with some distilled water and you can take this and you got plenty of time to rub it all over the piece of paper because with the extra water it gives you more gives you more drying time and you can just uh, you got plenty of time to spread it on there but yet it still dries real fast I mean, this will be dry in like a minute or so but uh, it, it soaks right in there real fast. Look at that. You, there's no more uh, liquid on the top of the paper now at all. And then you just flip it over and put a few drops on the other side. Same way. And uh, spread it around. Now the first paper with the that you put the borax it dries pretty fast too, but not like this. That acetone it evaporates out of there real fast. So this you can leave this set for a minute or so, and uh, you're ready to go. You can run your test on it. So it's it's super fast, and it, it makes a pretty nice membrane too. I I tested a battery with it, and uh, uh, you get you don't get the bleed through like you had before on it so uh, it's it's definitely doing a job and it produced some better power too so uh, the next video I'm going to uh, run a test uh, I'll, run a I'll build a battery with this and, uh, and we'll see how well it does alright talk to you next time